there's some big breaking news which is coming in and it's a relief for the film producer. Supreme Court has directed the West Bengal Chief Minister, Chief Secretary as well as the Principal Secretary of Home to take steps to ensure that there is no obstruction in the screening of the film Bhavishyar Bhut, a social and a political satire which has been facing a lot of criticism. Let's go across to Harish who's joining us. Finally, this is going to go a long way in setting a precedent as well that it is the job of the state government to ensure that there is adequate security for controversial films instead of passing the buck and wondering if scenes and dialogues ought to be snipped out. Yes, Meghna, exactly. Justice uh, D.V. Chandrachud, who has always been a champion of uh, freedom of expression, has made some major observations also during the hearing. Uh, he said that once the CBSC has certified a film, no one can, no force on the earth can come in the way of its uh, public exhibition. Uh, saying that the uh, Supreme Court has directed the West Bengal government to ensure that the screening of the film, Bhavishir Booth, takes place without unlawful, any of unlawful obstruction. Uh, the interim order was passed by the bench uh, uh, while issuing notice to the West Bengal government on a petition by producers of the film complaining that the film was taken off the theatres following an unofficial ban by the government. Uh, the film directed by Anik Dutta had, remember, ran into controversy due to its satirical content lampooning uh, political parties. Uh, the, the, uh, the director and producers of the film was represented by senior advocate Indra Unni Nair. In her petition, in, 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 in Creative Private Limited alleges that the, the state of West Bengal is misusing police power and acting as a super censor. It essentially asserts that there is such obstruction to the exhibition of the The reason movie. why these observations why? are very important because it sets a precedent. It's not a problem restricted only to the state of West Bengal but across the length and breadth of the country. Thank you so much for joining us, Harish.